Before we jump into installing Oracle Application Express, let's take a quick look to see what the architecture looks like in a typical Oracle Apex environment. Oracle Application Express lives inside the database. What does that mean exactly? Well, on a typical server, you'll have an Oracle database that's running, and inside the Oracle database will be a bunch of schemas that are associated with Oracle Application Express. These Apex schemas hold all of the pieces that make up Apex. That includes the development environment, the web pages to handle administration and creation of new users. Just about anything that you can associate with Apex are built into these schemas. I know what you're probably thinking. If everything lives inside the database, how is all of this served up to the end users and developers through their browsers? In the simplest configuration, a very lightweight HTTP server lives inside the database and serves up those pages to your end users and developers. This is not the way you would set up Apex in a production environment. This is fine for test and development and just learning Oracle Application Express. But if you were in a true production environment, you would break the HTTP server outside of the database and run it as an independent process. That HTTP server can run on the same physical server as the Oracle database, or it can run on a different server if you want a true end-tier configuration that goes along with your Apex environment. In later videos, we'll take a look at what it takes to break that HTTP server out into its own process. But for now, we're going to run the HTTP server that comes inside the Oracle database to do our demonstrations and lessons. 